What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to our Minecraft Mod Survival Season 2. And that's right, guys, we are back. And I know I didn't record on Monday, but that's because I was really tired. But today, let's start it off already with the Illuminati pets. Uh, no, that's not an Illuminati pet. <laughs> but there we go. We got dark gray stained glass, iron shovel, a tool forge slab. Okay, and great fabric. Okay, that's neat. Now, guys, as we were actually preparing last episode, I forgot to craft one thing, which is the reactor energy injector, which is a very key component to this thing. So, I mean, it's very simple in things, and as you guys see, I did a lot of, you know, grinding. <laughs> so, yeah, I did maybe like five more of these things. Yeah, <laughs> I did a lot of work. Let's just say that. And we're gonna grab a few of these. And hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> like I was just saying, we can craft one, two, three, four of these. And then it's. We need some of these. Um, and then it's. This. This we can actually already make, which is pretty good. So yeah, and that's how that goes. That just I don't know. But guys, today's main goal is to get the Chaos Shard. Or the Chaos Crystal, whatever you want to say. Now, why do we want this? Oh, I don't know. Maybe so we can create chaotic cores. Or, you know, kind of the literal reactor core. Yeah, you know, that'd be that'd be pretty good. <laughs> They're like the only two it can be used for, but yeah, so if you're wondering, well, how do you even get this thing? Well, 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 we got the Dragon Evo Draconic Evolution Information Tablet, so let's see what it says. I know the answer, how we get it, but let's see what it says. That's not what I was clicking on. See the page about Chaos Islands for more info. Hmm, Chaos Islands? What is you mean chaos islands? Well, let's see chaos islands looking for a challenge the fight of your life Dragon and the Dr ender dragon wasn't hard enough. Um, I mean the resurrected one looks different, but that's fine Maybe try 100 ender dragons all at once plus maybe a few dozen withers and if that's still not hard enough Then maybe this is for you if you travel to any multiple 10,000 in the end example zero 10,000, 0, 20,000, 10,000, 0, you'll find the Chaos Island. Yeah. And what do they have? Oh, don't worry. They just have the most ridiculous boss there is. I think this may actually be the hardest mob, boss, whatever you want to say, in any mod. Not lying. I feel like it is actually the hardest boss in any mod. But there's a reason why we got an Infaminer, you know. I totally don't want to just be able to go, wham, you're dead. That's, that's literally why I want it. That's literally why I got this thing super early. Because I knew one of these days we would be doing this fight. And we need to kill it. Because trust me guys, if you don't think this battle will be hard, it's ridiculously hard now i've actually never done this in 1.7 so and also let's hope my game doesn't crash it's the but, end great guy um excuse me i said let me fly out thank you now as you guys remember in this i mean it wasn't very long ago i just said it and you know we were like right here uh, we gotta go to a multiple of 10,000 blocks away from the 10,000 blocks. Oh, yay, what fun. <laughs> so, yeah, just remember, yeah, that's actually kind of what it looks like. Um, just know that it's gonna take a while to get there. Yeah, it's quite far away. So, let's open this up. We're flying, and... Yay, this is so fast. 
<laughs> Man, we fly so fast, guys. Yay. <laughs> oh, God, I'm totally teleporting. So that's TP. Uh, Marco Master YT. And now we're going to go 9,700. This, and then zero. Now, you may be like, Why'd you do that? Because that, I made, I teleported a few hundred blocks away because that way it makes it a bit better. I may be like, what do you mean by better? Well, you'll know. Also, I kind of feel like I should be watching my coordinates. Otherwise, I feel like I'm not even moving because it's so dark. Okay, I'm like reaching 10,000. Okay, I felt a bit of lag there. Okay, I'm at literally 10,000 zero. What do you mean? I do not have to go. I hear it. What the hell? Nope, nope, nope. I hear it. I literally hear it, but I cannot see a thing. What? Okay. We're gonna try and go up to. Four, four render distance. Thank you. I know I definitely took quick damage. I cannot see this thing. I can't see a thing. I actually can't see anything. What do you mean, game? Okay, guys. I am seriously confused. We're going in creative. We're going in creative. Because of the fact I can see. So that's attack. Okay, he's still attacking me. Okay, yeah, this literally just kind of makes it worse a little bit. I don't know, I can't even see him. I'm gonna go to the opposite side. Maybe this will work now. Maybe this will uh, not work. I think um, this may be the reason why it didn't work. Okay. Which direction? No, that's bad. So we gonna go west. Okay, let's go west. Okay, hopefully we'll see something this time. <laughs> I don't know. I'm. I don't know if it's still buggy. Because it's still. Every time you no no it. It doesn't want to show it this time, but every time you first log into a world, it always shows like, ah yes, we hope that we fix this. I don't think they did. Yeah. We're at negative 10,000. Oh, wait, we are very far away. Uh, no, that's. I think we gotta go north. Yeah, we're like a hundred blocks away, so. Okay, let's keep going this way a bit. Keep going completely like north. And. Yeah, we're pretty much here. I hear the dragon, I do not see it. You guys can literally see that we do not see a thing. I think it's just buggy, which is really annoying because I actually really wanted to do this boss fight. I thought it'd be really like fun and kind of neat to do, but it's literally not even possible in this version, which is actually kind of annoying. So we have to cheat in Chaos Shards. Wow. Unless you want to say, like, it's really far up. But I don't think that's the case. I can't even go any farther up. That means there's an island above me, yet I can't see it. Or something. Something's blocking me from going up. I am so confused. I can't see a thing. Nope, we're going teleporting. Zero, zero, zero. Okay, I can't even see the normal island. What do you mean? Guys, we'll be back. 
I think it's just my game, and I can't even see anything naturally, so... I guess we'll have to cheat in because I can't do anything, which is really annoying. So, I'm gonna just do that. And it'll probably spawn us back at base. Hopefully that stuff will load in. But I'm guessing nothing was loading in, like I just said, because my computer probably just can't handle it for some reason. I don't know. Very weird, but I really wanted to actually do that fight stuff spawning in so that tell me it's good there oh uh, yes the hearts have to do that i'll turn put that back on i wasn't sure if that was blocking my vision or not guys that's why i had that off um let's put those away so since that happened i don't know why i actually went out of creative i need to Get a chaos shard, or no, I gotta get multiple chaos shards because if I don't, then I can only craft one thing with them, and that's like one chaos core. So let's see, I need well, I don't know how many actually. I get the chaos shard and chaos crystal. We only need the shards there. We're going to grab 64 for now, but we probably won't need that, so I'm actually going to go in here and look at everything we need real quick. So, we need four chaotic cores, which requires four of them. Four, and I mean five. What else can we use the, no, not the, the chaotic cores for? Okay, we can only use it for this. We can only use chaotic cores for that, so we only need four for that. And then we only need five. Okay, so we only need five of them total. Okay. That makes sense. Boom, we got five. And there we go. We have the five that we need. Now let's craft everything we need for the reactor. And then, next episode will be when we have the reactor. So... Let's do this. We'll probably need quite a bit of stuff, so. And then, let's see. Can we craft this right away? No, we cannot, probably because we need chaotic cores. That would make sense. Right, so we have three of them, but we need more of these. That's right. Two, three. Should be all we need. The last chaotic core. And then, we should also be able to go... We got the reactor core. Remember, that can't do anything in my inventory right now, so we should be good. Like I said, should. And then there's all that. So, from what I know, we'll pretty much have it in a setup kind of like this. Um, pretty much like this. Where all these, well, if my game decides to uh, like, not like, um, all the reactor stabilizers are in the air, pointing right at it from like a few blocks away. While the reactor energy injector, injector, not injector, um, is below it on the floor, so in shooting right into it, and that's how that should be working. So that's how it works. And if I'm not wrong, these are actually the things that are taking the energy out, this is what puts the energy in, from what I know, so, we also need four blocks of actual awakened draconium for this reactor to start, so, next episode, guys, we will actually be creating the reactor, and hopefully, we don't cause it to explode immediately, because that's, I gonna be devastating if it does but i hope you guys enjoyed like and subscribe and i will see you guys next time have a good day goodbye sorry for the sorry for these extra late uploads